And who can forget last year when it was hard to get your hands on chicken wings? Luckily, that's not the case this year, but there are still many sports bars preparing for Sunday's big game. Our Ken McCoy spoke with one local restaurant owner on their preparation. All right, guys, so who doesn't love a good wing? Practically everybody, right? And if they say they don't, they're lying to you, and you really shouldn't hang around people like that. But anyway, I'm here at West End Grill to talk to them about how they're getting prepared for the big game. We've had some very good Super Bowls that uh, when there's a lot of interest, you know, that brings people out. There's no better place to watch a major sporting event than at your local sports bar. People show up for the Super Bowl, but in general, it's uh, just it's a uh, team entry. And I think with the uh, Hurts playing for Philadelphia, it creates a lot of interest in the local community. West End Grill is one of many sports bars in the area gearing up to cheer on their Alabama favorites. Well, the biggest start is, is just uh, doing food prep and getting ready. If you know, like typically it's Super Bowl and several other holiday events, you sell a lot of wings, a lot of burgers and uh, steaks and stuff like that. So it's just having to go through the prep and make sure we're prepared. If uh, if we, if everybody shows up, then we'll we got to be ready. Ready for it. Experts estimate that 1.5 billion chicken wings will be consumed during Super Bowl weekend. This is the highest projection on record, according to the National Chicken Council. Yeah, last year we were having uh, we were having some issues. Not only were there uh, trouble getting wings, but the price of them was over three times what they were the year before. So luckily, the chicken market has gotten a little better over the last four or five months. Oh. To be honest with you, and uh, availability has gotten better. But so outside of wings, what's the best part of coming to a sports bar? We have a lot of locals that come in here, uh, regulars, I should say. And uh, we could like to consider ourselves like a sort of a cheers atmosphere, you know, about about 30 years later. But, uh, you know, we, we everybody just gets along and, you know, don't meet many strangers in here. At West End Grill, Ken McCoy, Fox 54 News.